And we're back. Thanks for coming here. Talk about stuff. This is Mugen. Talk about Mugen stuff. Uh, using Hypercam. Okay, I like using Bandicam. Okay, but the issue with Bandicam is Bandicam works for stuff that moves really fast because it gets it a good high frame rate. Uh, but it only works for 10 minutes, and of course, high frame rate means bigger fi video files. The cool thing about this is that uh, this is how we can uh, I can adjust the frame rate the problem is it's not, not really the best for showing off gameplay footage you know which I'll use Benny cam for that for this though I I, 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 go, I, go, I can't want to uh, me to head hurt all right so with this though I'm using uh, hypercam I only got a few frames a second it works just fine for something like this because this is going to be still images for a good while longer now here's the deal this is the last picture the last frame of, of picture I'm going to be doing for for Cuphead, you know, my Cuphead Mugen character, uh, as far as I can tell, unless there's an issue with the coloring. But uh, if there isn't, then this is the last picture. What I want to do is I kind of want to get rid of this because that's an ink. Well, that's some ink from uh, oh, when I when I drew it, drew over it. Uh, let's see how this works. Okay, what you need to do is go to the eyedropper tool, click the white thing icon. There you go. That must be better. There you go. There you go. Come on, go on down. Go on down. Come on. There you are. See, there you are. There you go. Mm -hmm. Got to check on that. There you go. All right. Uh, eyedropper tool on this white part. Then uh, click on this. And now that is uh, going to be th th this kind of white here, like the paper I used to make this. And I can then get rid of this stuff right here. Huh? Make it look him look a little bit less uh, angry, I guess. A little, a little less weird. So yeah, there you go. So that looks a little better. I can even get rid of that part, that stuff over there too. If I want to. Yeah, it looks a little better. All right. So I'm good with that. Uh, let's go edit. Uh, funnel file. I'm gonna export as what? This is Cuphead. Cuphead. Uh, small pick. Two L's in small. Yeah, I'm going to work on that. P I C dot PCX. It has a PCX file for it to work with Mugen. And there you go. Now it's all done. And I'm going to X out. Discard the changes. There you go. Now, that is the last picture. Basically, I finished. What happens, what is, what happens is you got to get through all these, cut and paste all these pictures. And I got them all. And they're all in there. And now it is time for me to leave GIMP. Thank you very much, GIMP. You're amazing. Uh, that's for some stuff that uh, won't be over on YouTube. Well, this stuff is on YouTube by Adam Savage. But this stuff will never be on YouTube because uh, there's copyright infringement. Because it's videos uh, with um, copyright music and copyright videos, of course. But uh, I still like making them. I used to make those all the time, but I, I, I got in trouble and lost the channel because of those things. So um, I only make them just for my own, entertain my own entertainment, maybe my, my mom and brother and sister's entertainment, maybe, maybe if they're interested in them. But yeah, definitely just for me because it's fun. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. You can do some cool stuff. You know, some love songs and some awesome fighting situations. You can have all kinds of different things. It's really cool. It's really cool. But I don't know. No, I can't be showing you that. What I am going to show you, of course, is making, taking, doing the second step. Okay, this is the that was the first step, uh, com uh basically the computer step on you uh, of making a moving character on uh, of making a moving character. You scan the uh, character's sprite sheet in. Where, where is it? Where is it? Okay, the sprite sheet is right over here. So Commander Keen, that's those for later. Mm, it'll be a different Mugen character. Mm, there'll be other Mugen characters. <laughs> okay, now you later. All right, now I got this to do. Okay, you got the Cuphead sprite sheet right here. All right. And I basically scan that in on my scanner, my little scanner here. And uh, then I basically went through all of his uh, frames. Each and every frame, each and every picture on this thing, I basically cut, paste, and colored in with the color that's going to, I'm going to make Mugen say is registers as invisible. Mm, I'm going to do that. But I should have all those colors in there. What I need to do now is go to Mugen. Do, do we have Mugen? Mm, oh my gosh. It's been a long time. I don't know. Do, do we have that? Do we have Mugen? Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. I, I, I don't know. Uh oh. Mm. I don't know if I've ever done Mugen. On here. The actual Mugen. M U G. Yeah. Mugen. Okay. So it, it is there. Mugen's there. So, uh, yeah. Or is it Win Mugen? Uh, w7 neutral 12. Uh. 
Well, it's somewhere, but we'll find it. Is it in M? Then no, the files are their own files. That is a little weird. Bluetooth Commander Keen downloads. Mugen. Yeah, there it is. There it is. There it is. There's Mugen right there. Click on that. All right, go to characters. Hey, oh, yeah, the extra fate. Oh my gosh. So yeah, it has been a long while since I've done a Mugen character. All right. So yeah, but we're back in there. We're gonna get that stuff done. Let's see here. A new folder and Newman Paul. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's a fun thing that uh, I think the uh, Al Zip or somebody does. We're not gonna call us Paul Newman. We're gonna call us Cuphead. Cuphead. Click. Then uh, Cuphead. We open Cuphead. The Cuphead Mugen. We get uh, the other one. Uh, download. I think we need to download the documents here. The documents folder, I go to Cuphead. All the up. Yeah, no more Starco is coming. So let's go. But right now, now we got work to do. Okay, got Cuphead, combo break. Get in there. Okay, combo break to. We're moving them all over. And now, the doing doing that can take a little while, so I can do this. Let's hi highlight them all. Mm. Click and pr press and hold my right, my left click button. Highlight them all. And just grab them all and th move them over here. Mm. All right. So then let's see here. We have one, a few more left. The cup had big pick. Cup had small pick. Throw that there too. Click. You have cup had dazed. Click. And cup had stand walk. All right. There we go. So I think we have all the cup head is now now in its own file, which is perfect. Which is just what you need. You need that stuff. So that's all in there. It's all together. It's all good. Click. Now we uh, go back. All right. I need to go to Kung Fu Man, KFM. All right. I need to take all these mm -mm. and copy them. Mm. Okay. I did things wrong. Okay. Mm. Uh, a different way, the, the wrong way, which was I made a file and then put all the Cuphead sprites uh, pictures in there. What I should have done was copy Kung Fu Man, rename it Cuphead, and then done this. But that's okay. I can just do it like this. Paste. And that's put all the Kung Fu Man stuff in there. Kung Fu Man? What am I thinking? No, 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 no. I forgot. This is not a Kung Fu Man character. Delete. Those are my first characters I ever made. It was a Kung Fu Man character. All right. Uh, I don't do that anymore. What I do instead is go here. And, uh, yeah, get all these. Thank you. Copy. It's good. Idol. I make idol characters from Killer Instinct. Idol from Killer Instinct characters now. So I did paste. Paste. There we go. That's what we want. Now we got all the idol stuff in here. And what we're going to do is we're going to, uh, let's see here, find the right thing. That's the one reason I, I like having hybrid cam instead of bandy cam for this. Because mm, okay. I could take as long as I need. You know, and just go through and make it all one part. Mm -hmm. All right, with Bandicam, it'd be like ten minutes. You have ten minutes, and that's it. And you gotta do it, and, it, and then it's a huge file, and it's weird. So now yeah, we got this going. Okay, what we got here is you got a few things. This is an air file. We don't need to um, unzip this. Wind wears like yeah, we don't want to. You can uh, unzip that. Like no, you don't. You don't need to do that. We have the idle command. That's the command, right? Idle command. Command script. No, no, we don't need that. The CNS. Uh, I believe the CNS or the SFF. Let me see here. Uh, okay, what are these with? Used with? Open with? Um, usually we use Notepad. So let's, let's go see if we can uh, handle this. Notepad. Yes. Go. See what it looks like. Okay. Yeah, this is the one. CNS is the one we want. The idle uh, CNS is the one we want. Constants and states is the one we want. So let's go here. We have this thing. We have life 100. Uh, yeah, we're going to lower that because idle is amazing. Attack is 100. Life's fine. Attack is too high. So, yeah. Cuphead's uh, not exactly that powerful. So we'll say... Well, he's not really. All right. You, see, you get the little little tiny things there. We'll say... Um, right now we'll go with 20. Mm -hmm. Okay, 20 for uh, attack. Defense, so I'll leave alone for now. And then we'll see how he looks. The air juggle's fine. The KO is fine. Oh, and all this stuff's fine. What we want is... Oh, this is the right. This is not the right one. No, it's not. <laughs> no, 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 this is an important one. All right, we'll figure that out once we get this done here. Uh, file save. All right, get here. What we want to do is, of course, go to the SFF. Wait, which one we want? That's command. What's the SFF? Let's find out. Open with uh, an SFF file. 
More apps, please. Or oh, notepad. Mm, a lot of notepad with Mugen. And if it's all gobbledygook, this is the wrong file. Mm, it's all gobbledygook. It's the wrong file. <laughs> so I get rid of that one. Uh, let's see. What is that? That's the music. That's the soundtrack. These are all palettes. Mm, so we don't want those. So what am I looking for here? Right. Idle what? That's the CNS file. I, I thought we had this. Wait a minute. Uh, go back in there. Uh, constant states. Size. Velocity, movement. No, 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 I don't want those. I don't want those right now. I want the other ones. Okay. Uh, what is this? I don't. Oh, the def. This is the one we want. The def file. So what I knew is I go over here, open with Notepad, open, open. Okay. Now what we need to do here is change Idol's name to Cuphead. Mm. Cuphead. Okay. Display name is Cuphead. Cuphead. Okay. A command. Oh, yeah. All this stuff is good here because this is basically this is the brains of the uh, of the character. You know, basically the, when the when Mugen wants to make the character work, it'll come here to the DEF and be like, okay, what's the character I'm looking for? Uh, Cuphead. Uh, yeah. There's his display name. There's all this other cool stuff. There's his command. Well, I go to command files. I go to CES or the nervous system maybe. You know, both probably brain too, but yeah, brain too. Uh, constants of states, all these other stuff like that. What I want is. The sprites can be idle SFF. We're gonna deal with that in a little bit. But first, what's your animation idle air? Uh, sound idle sound act. Okay. What we need to do is change this. This color thing won't work so well. So we need a uh, new. Mm. We need a new one. So uh, let's say uh, wait 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 file save. We don't save as. We just save. Okay. Now I'm gonna go and get a kung fu man or somebody else's. Uh, I guess Action Fate will work. Because we did the same thing long ago. I did the same thing with Action Fate. What I want is an Action Fate or... What is this? Axe File. Or the KFM Act File. Copy. That Kung Fu, there, the Kung Fu Man Act File that is the right palette that I want. Give me Cuphead. And go to the Idol... Uh, idol. Oh, Cuphead, actually. Mm -hmm. Cuphead. Oh, it needs to be called that. What is this? That's the CNS file. That's the uh, def DEF file. What is it? SFF. I don't want the SFF. I want the DEF file. The DEF file needs to be changed. Rename. Cuphead. Cuphead. Oh, it needs to be changed. The cool thing is it can be capitalized or not capitalized as long as it's uh, the same spaces. Cuphead SFF file. Uh, no, you know, DEF file. I need, uh, oh, wait, wait. Oh, click, click. Paste. Here. KFM. Rename. Mm -hmm, I can do that. <laughs> Copy. Work smarter, not harder, you know. Take whatever shortcut you can when it comes to something like this, you know. That's what I'm doing. Uh, let's see here. What we need to do is go to PAL. One is not idle one. It's going to be... KFM.act. Paste. Yeah. KFM.act. And then I save that. Save. Alright. X. Alright. Now. Uh this has been a while. Okay, this is a char this is Moog this is a character. Okay, we're gonna see if it works. Okay. This is the character. Oh yeah, first I gotta go to uh select data. Right. And select Man, it's been a long time. Oh my gosh. Yes, all this cool stuff. Where is it? KFM stage KFM. KFM Hat Kid. Yeah, that's what it was. I did ha played Hat Kid. I can do this, though, if I did this right. That's the Hat Kid. Dot def. Actually, copy. I can have one more than that if I want to. So I'll make another ca another slot. Paste. And then change SB to Cuphead. Mm. Cuphead. Stage is KFM dot def. File. Save. There's a lot of stuff that's kind of, you know, definitely kind of programming style, you know, command script. Well, I don't know about command script, but programming stuff. So let's let's see if this works. Of course, that music is something that's going at two frames a second, so we're not trying to, I'm not trying to show it off in its full glory yet. <laughs> he's not even uh, sprite swapped yet, so let's go see how it works. Where are you? 
There you go. All right. Yeah, this. Uh, yeah, the arcade mode. Uh, let's see here. Oh, oh yes. I'm used to that stuff. What am I talking? So you know, L. Yes. Okay. So let's look. Yeah. See, there he is. There's Cuphead, with, with the idol stuff still on top of him. I haven't gotten to that part yet. Let's see what it looks like. I'm gonna fight Cat, Cat Kid with no head. Oh my gosh. So he, he he does work. Oh boy, wait, wait. Okay. I, I see. Okay. So it is working. Cuphead's working. That's good. All right. That's what we wanted to see. But now we have to you know, go to the next step. And the next step is Fighter Factory. Where Where is Fighter Factory? It should be here. Click on this. It's a long time to do Fighter Factory. This is Fighter Factory Classic. So now we go here to Fighter Factory Classic. Man. Ah, uh, yes. Yes, it is like a lot of walks on in real lane going on around here. And I like that. Open that character. Mm. And now we go to uh, Mugen. Mm. Mugen. Characters. Cuphead. Uh, we want Cuphead's uh, death file. Open. Let's access Cuphead. There you go. And now we have the, the um, sprite, the, 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 the uh, palette we want. <laughs> You know, we can make our own palettes, but thankfully you don't have to because that takes a little time. But we did it. We have a, a palette already made and copied. So now what we can do is go over here to we have the sprites. Uh, you think the sprites together with sprites, and now we can go through everything. Okay, so what we have is all this stuff over here. That's the small pick, and the uh, this is the big pick. No, no, let's walk. Let's stand, stand, walk, jump. Yeah, yeah, okay, so we got all that going. What we want to do now is uh, pick one, okay? This is small pick, so we want to go to small pick. What is that one? Change, cup head, wait, oh no, I forgot. There is another step, isn't there? Mm, yes, there is. No, there isn't. That's serious. <laughs> I think there is. I think there, there truly is, but we'll see. We'll see right now. Uh, cup head, small pick, please. Small pick. We'll see if we need to do that step, but first let's go. Click. All right, there we go. Ah, <laughs> cover it. It's all thick. I think we do. Mm -hmm. Do we? Oh yeah. Oh, uh, there we go. There's a problem. There's our issue. Oh boy. Um. Yeah, we we need to work on that because now we got that going. Um, I think. Unless it's not. Uh, well, I don't know. Well, well, whatever. That's the way it goes. You you basically do that, and then I just gotta do another one here. This is his stand. We go to uh, stand right here. Stand walk. Oh shoot! I forgot all that. Mm. I need to make a few stand walks because I don't want them all clashing. Mm. That's the issue. Open. Yeah, I take that. I put you here. Come ahead. There you go. There he is, right there. Looking good. A little bit of smudgy in the mouth section. Dang it! I have to work on that. I don't know. And I can save it all. There you go. And uh, yeah, see, say, see you guys next time. Check me out on YouTube and DeviantArt. Uh, I got some work to do to uh, basically sprite swap all this. This is uh, basically each type of uh, work, each type of uh, you know step of making a Mugen character is uh, a bit of is a different kind of, of tedium because uh, basically you have to cut all cut and paste color and cut and paste and color all the different sprites then you got to cut you know, all the different pictures frames animation then you got to paste all uh, sprite swap all these sprites and stuff like that and then you got to do with their collision boxes and then you got to do sound you know and that's how it goes and you got to clean it up make sure it works right before you release it but the cool thing is it's all worth it because it looks it's gonna look super cool once it's done right now though It's time for me to get started on this stuff. I'll see you guys next time Check me out on YouTube. You've been doing art getting in there hooking these things up uh, Even you know even while uh, quarantined, but don't worry. We're, we're getting we're gonna get through that. It'll be great